Hey there all YouTubers. Today it's smoked and grilled chicken wings in my modified Traeger pellet grill. First thing is I got these nice meaty wings. Look at all that meat on there. Very nice. I like to rinse them with cold water and then I like to pat them dry. Get all that water off of there. Now once they're patted dry I like to hit them with a little bit of olive oil. Get a nice coating on there. Mix them all up. Now that we have them coated with olive oil, we're going to hit them with this ranch dressing seasoning. After a nice coating of the ranch seasoning, we're going to hit it with the Frank's Red Hot seasoning. Now that they're seasoned on both sides, into the refrigerator they go while I set up that pit. Alright, so here we have my Traeger pellet grill. And what I have here is the top rack. That's where I will be smoking the wings. Down here, that's the firebox. I took out the inside heat deflector. And what I have here is a cast iron smoke box that I use to where I put my hot griddle plate all the way across here. It sits on this ledge right here. It sits right there. Now I have my lodge griddle plate in there, as you can see, sitting real nice on that ledge. And now on that smoke box, and it has about an inch and a half clearance between the fire pot and the griddle plate. All right, we're going to take it to the next level. What I have here is a Lodge carbon steel skillet. Big Lou over at Big Lou's Barbecue has one of these, and I told him my next video I would be using this. What I'm going to do is I'm going to smoke the wings, and then I'm going to get a nice grill and crisp up that skin in this skillet. That's right, carbon steel skillet. All right, let's get it turned on. Today I'll be using oak pellets. All right, the pit's coming up the temp. I have it set at 180. It runs a little hotter. As you can see, it's around 200, 204. All right, that's just the right amount of wings. They're a little crowded up there, but got them all on. Don't you love the sound of that fan? So after a half an hour getting some pretty good smoke at this lower temp, let's go ahead and kick it up to 225, which now it's going to run probably around 250, 275. All right, so after another half hour, let's kick it up another notch, 250. That should run around 275, 300. Oh yeah, look at those. Getting good. Alright, so after an hour and 15 minutes, internal temp 165, and crisp that skin up. Oh man, this smells terrific. Listen to that sizzle. So I've turned the thermostat on high. Look at the nice, nice crisp sear I'm getting on these wings. Now that we've got nice color, crisp up that skin, I'm going to turn the thermostat down the smoke. And I'm going to hit them with some of this sweet baby rays buffalo wing sauce. Stir them around. And these wings are just about done. Stir them around in that sauce. Oh, man. Let's go ahead and 
plate them up. Okay, let's get a taste of these. Wow, look at that. Nice caramelization of that skin. Wow, look at that. Let's get a taste. Well, I gotta tell you, excellent flavor from this combination of the seasonings. The ranch and the Frank's Red Hot. And then Crisping up that skin in that uh, skillet really makes it. I tell you, these are awesome, guys. Well, that's all we got today. Thanks for watching. Keep it metal.